Donald Trump hasn't had the best of luck when it comes to umbrellas. The president found himself at the center of another umbrella-related snafu on Saturday as he boarded Air Force One at Andrews Air Force Base in D. See in videos documenting the moment, Trump, 72, can be seen holding the device over his head while making his way up the stairs to the aircraft. However, as he proceeded to enter the plane, he lowered the still-opened umbrella, which was wider than the aircraft door, to the ground. After he appeared to drag it along the ground for a few moments, instead of closing the umbrella, he simply released the handle, leaving it to wobble on the ground instead. Another man is later seen walking by the umbrella without picking it up before a Secret Service agent runs up the steps to easily close the umbrella and take it inside. The video prompted many social media users to jokingly question whether the president knew how to close umbrellas. At the time the viral video was taken, the president was en route to Indianapolis, where he spoke at the Future Farmers of America convention. During his speech, Trump drew criticism for joking about the bad hair day he was having when just hours earlier 11 people were killed and six people were injured by a gunman at a synagogue in Pittsburgh. By the way, somebody just said, your hair looks different today, Trump remarked. I said, well, I was standing under the wing of Air Force One doing a news conference early this morning, a very unfortunate news conference. And the wind was blowing in the rain, and I was soaking wet, and that's what I ended up with today. And I said, at least you know it's mine, he added. Just days earlier, Trump was caught on camera committing a different umbrella faux pas. As the president exited the White House with his wife Melania Trump on Monday, en route to visit Hurricane Tour in Florida and Georgia, he was seen holding the umbrella over his head, while the First Lady, 48, stood nearby, uncovered. After his wife joined him under the umbrella he was carrying, the president darted off to talk to a group of reporters about his wife's ABC News interview and his 60 Minutes interview, leaving his wife out in the rain. She did.